right? And when you see, there's no artist, let me be clear, there's no artist in this industry that's doing major numbers with these platforms that haven't sell they sold. As you guys are coming in that you can hear me and see me, I'm pretty sure that you can. This is some exclusive, exclusive tea. We all know that Jay-Z and Beyonce are two of the most powerful figures in the entertainment industry. But what if that power wasn't just about selling records and dominating charts? What if it went much deeper into the realm of manipulation, control, and even silencing critics who dared to speak out against them? Rumors are swirling that the Carters might not just be the flawless icons we all thought, but instead they could be pulling strings behind the scenes, making sure their carefully curated image stays untouchable. And with all the recent whispers about their connection to other big scandals in the industry, it's hard not to wonder, are Jay-Z and Beyonce panicking because their empire might be starting to crack? There's no vindication for me because for four years I've been screaming, not just Diddy, but Diddy and Jay-Z are monsters. And the victim making machine kept going on. It all started when Jaguar Wright, a singer from the 90s, made some jaw dropping allegations on Piers Morgan's show. Jaguar didn't hold back. She claimed that Jay Z had been involved in taking down R. Kelly, saying that the Me Too movement wasn't what it seemed. Instead, according to her, it was a well orchestrated plan funded by Jay Z to throw R. Kelly under the bus and shift attention away from his own skeletons. Now, that's a pretty wild accusation, but what really caught people's attention wasn't just what Jaguar said. It was how quickly the Carter's legal team reacted. Special housing unit is a 24-hour lockdown unit, which means that any movement within that unit is controlled and coordinated, and no inmate moves outside of his cell without being in full restraints to include uh, leg irons, handcuffs, a belly chain, and at least... Reports started flying that Jay-Z and Beyonce's lawyers immediately contacted Piers Morgan, forcing him to edit out that part of the interview. And we're not talking about a polite request here. This was full-on legal pressure, demanding that the segment be removed and threatening legal action if it wasn't. Piers himself admitted that he had to comply with the demands, even though his show is literally called Uncensored. He apologized to the Carters, and the entire portion of Jaguar's interview where she spilled the tea about Jay-Z was wiped clean from public view. Mm. Oh, oh, Mr. Uh, Diddy, a.k.a. Mr. Love. Nap, Dr. No, Love. Sean Carter. Oh, so, oh, 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 Jay. But why would two of the most influential people in the world need to go to such lengths to shut down a few words from Jaguar, right? It feels like something much bigger is going on. Is this the first sign of a crumbling empire with Jay-Z and Beyonce scrambling to silence anyone who gets too close to exposing something deeper? Jay-Z has been notable by his silence since uh, these charges were brought against Diddy. Why do you think that is? Because that's what he does. He starts little fires everywhere, forces everyone involved to go and carry water while he sneaks away without a response that changes now, Sean. Jaguar's claims aren't the only time we've seen the Carters act swiftly and aggressively to shut people up. In fact, bloggers, social media influencers, and even regular fans have reportedly received similar threats. Several online personalities have come forward saying they were contacted by Jay-Z and Beyonce's team after posting videos or comments about the couple. And here's the kicker. These people weren't even making serious allegations. They were just speculating or sharing opinions, but even that was apparently enough to get a warning from the Carter camp. Some influencers have even issued public apologies, clearly out of fear of what might happen if they didn't comply. I know so much on how you got where you are, how you stepped on many people. One fan's apology stood out in particular. After receiving an email from Beyonce's legal team, this person didn't just take down their post. They practically begged for forgiveness in a new video, apologizing to Be Once, Jay-Z, and even their children. The fans' fear was palpable, saying they didn't want any trouble and hoped the Carters would accept their apology. The message was clear. If you cross Beyonce and Jay-Z, no matter how small your platform is, you'll hear from their lawyers. That kind of power over regular people just shows the lengths they'll go to protect their image. What I've heard about them as a couple is that they've been living separate lives for a very long time. This pattern of controlling the narrative becomes even more intriguing when you look at how Jay-Z and Beyonce seem to use their wealth and status to manipulate the media and influence major movements. It's no secret that they have a hand in everything, from music to fashion to politics. But what if they're also using that influence to keep any potential scandals at bay? Some speculate that the Carters have even funded movements like Me Too, not out of altruism, but as part of a larger plan to protect their empire. 
Jaguar Wright went so far as to accuse Jay-Z of using the movement as a tool to take out his competition, namely R. Kelly. And he was working with R. Kelly and they were making so many records together. You know, they made all of those records together. They both fucked Aaliyah. They shared so much in common. Think about it. Jay-Z and R. Kelly were once collaborators, but their relationship soured. Jaguar's theory suggests that Jay-Z used the Me Too movement to ensure R. Kelly's downfall, diverting attention away from his own alleged wrongdoings. It's a wild accusation, but if true, it paints Jay-Z as not just a businessman, but a mastermind who knows exactly how to play the system to his advantage. By backing a movement that gained widespread support, he could have taken down R. Kelly while solidifying his own image as a supporter of women's rights and justice. After they are done with Diddy, Jay-Z is up next to be exposed, right? And let's not forget how Beyonce has navigated the public's perception over the years. She's known for being meticulous about her image, rarely giving interviews, and always maintaining an air of mystery. Her fan base, known as the Bayhive, is fiercely protective, and that's no accident. Beyonce has built a persona that's nearly untouchable, one that transcends criticism. But that kind of control over your public image doesn't happen by accident. It takes power, influence, and some might say manipulation behind the scenes. This is what I look for. When I see a success, I'm looking for anything to say that they didn't do it on their own. It. Yeah, detain it, not to say That's it. Not a good the idea that Jay-Z and Beyonce are using their influence to suppress stories and control narratives isn't just about their reputation. It's about protecting something much bigger. More and more people are starting to question whether there's something they're hiding, something that goes beyond just maintaining a squeaky clean public persona. And Stacey, you say today's indictment reads like a mob indictment. What was most shocking to you of all these allegations? Yeah, the fact, Jake, that the government in, in this indictment presented evidence alleging that Sean Cones was running a criminal enterprise. Some even believe that the couple's connection to larger industry scandals is starting to surface. Their close friendship with Sean Diddy Combs has raised eyebrows, especially with everything going down in Diddy's world lately. Diddy has been embroiled in controversy for months, with multiple allegations against him ranging from secretive parties to disturbing accusations that go far beyond what the public has seen before. And yet Jay-Z and Beyonce have remained suspiciously quiet about their longtime friend. And a lot of the evidence, alleged evidence, that's been gathered in this case was from those two raids that were conducted on his personal homes in Miami and Los Angeles. And the indictment names the, um, the, the things seized that, they, that he allegedly made videos of these performances as, mm -hmm. that have been named freak offs. Could it be that they're trying to distance themselves before the heat really turns up? Or even worse, are they actively involved in covering up for Diddy's darker dealings? There's been speculation that the Carters might be implicated in some of the accusations against Diddy, especially given how closely their inner circles have been connected for years. And if that's the case, it would explain why they're going to such extreme lengths to silence anyone who gets too close to the truth. You know, I think in federal court and for these charges, they would say it's routine, but in the public realm, this is very significant, just from who we associate Diddy being and everything we've seen him do over the decades. Like you said, this is quite the downfall to go from, I mean, we saw the mansions back, back in March that were raided by the feds. So to go from living in those mansions to being in a jail cell. Jay-Z and Beyonce's influence is undeniable. But as more stories start to emerge, the cracks in their seemingly perfect facade are becoming harder to ignore. If they've been pulling strings behind the scenes for years, using their power to manipulate the media, control movements, and silence critics, then we might be looking at a much bigger scandal than anyone could have anticipated. Their connection to Diddy and the growing rumors of their involvement in covering up his alleged activities are just the tip of the iceberg. Why doesn't the government want him to turn himself in? Because then they can't ask for detention. So they go and they arrest him. They arrest a guy who came to New York to turn himself in. What makes this all the more fascinating is that despite their best efforts, more and more people are speaking out. Jaguar Wright may have been silenced by Piers Morgan's team, but that didn't stop her from continuing to share her story on other platforms. And she's not the only one. Other industry insiders are starting to whisper about the Carter's possible role in keeping certain stories buried. And it seems like it's only a matter of time before those whispers turn into full-blown revelations. But after that major documentary comes out on Diddy, then you're going to start to hear more and more about Jay-Z in his nefarious past, okay? It's almost like we're watching the beginning of the end of their reign. Jay-Z and Beyonce might still hold a lot of power, but even the most powerful empires eventually fall, especially when they're built on secrets and lies. And right now, it feels like those secrets are starting to come to the surface. No, this part is not alleged. Jay-Z and his team, they have been ducking and dodging, taking the DNA test. 
As more voices join the chorus of those accusing the Carters of manipulation and control, it's clear that their attempts to silence critics might not be working as well as they hope. They've spent years cultivating an image of perfection, but the truth has a way of getting out eventually, and when it does, it's going to be explosive. What's even more intriguing is the possibility that all of this manipulation and media control could be a cover-up for something even darker. While Jay-Z and Beyonce's legal threats might be enough to scare some people into silence, others are refusing to back down. The more they try to control the narrative, the more people are starting to wonder, what are they really hiding? What's so important that they're willing to go to these lengths to keep it under wraps? Problems that are the defense has brought up originally, but it seems like, just from reading this 14-page indictment, that there is enough physical evidence to perhaps get a conviction in this case. We well shall see, these are allegations. The rumors about their connection to Diddy scandals have only fueled speculation that Jay-Z and Beyonce might be involved in something much bigger than we realize. And with Diddy now facing serious legal trouble, the Carter's involvement could soon come to light. As the investigation into Diddy's activities heats up, it's not just his empire that's at risk. Jay-Z and Beyonce could find themselves dragged into the fray as well. We're already seeing signs that their control over the narrative is slipping. Despite their best efforts, more and more people are speaking out, and the stories they're telling paint a very different picture of Jay-Z and Beyonce than the one they've spent years cultivating. The idea that they've been using their power and influence to silence critics, manipulate movements, and cover up potential criminal activity is shocking, but it's starting to look more and more plausible as time goes on. Our lives, and we may actually see one of the biggest divorces in Hollywood is because Jay-Z is up next to be exposed. And that brings us to the real question. How long can they keep this up? How long can Jay-Z and Beyonce continue to control the narrative before everything comes crashing down around them? If these rumors are true, it's only a matter of time before their empire starts to unravel. The Carters might be powerful, but they're not invincible. And right now, it seems like the truth is closing in on them faster than they ever expected. It's best of both worlds. Nobody talks about that. Nobody project. talks about this yet. Nobody they, they, talks they, about they, that they project. They swept that smooth under the rug. Why? <laughs> As the whispers of Jay-Z and Beyonce's possible involvement in media manipulation and silencing critics grow louder, another layer of intrigue begins to unfold, one that goes beyond controlling narratives and maintaining their pristine public image. The deeper question on everyone's mind now is, what are they hiding? And more specifically, how far are they willing to go to keep those secrets buried? This brings us to one of the most shocking parts of the rumors surrounding the Carters, their potential connection to the growing scandals tied to shown Diddy Combs. It's no secret that Jay-Z and Diddy have been close for years, collaborating on multiple projects and sharing the same elite social circles. But now that Diddy is facing a massive scandal that threatens to blow open secrets about his inner world, people are starting to wonder whether the Carters have more than just a casual friendship with the embattled music mogul. Since took Sean Diddy Combs into custody. He's seen in this video entering the Park Hyatt Hotel in Midtown Manhattan with others when agents from Homeland Security Investigations approach and separate him. They place Combs under arrest and lead him out the front door in handcuffs. Let's dive into what's really going on behind the scenes. Diddy's name has been making headlines for all the wrong reasons lately, with multiple allegations coming to light about his private life and his infamous parties. These aren't just your average celebrity gatherings either. There are claims that these events were far more secretive and much darker than anyone imagined. What's even more disturbing is that Diddy allegedly hosted what some are calling freak off, parties where high profile guests would partake in activities that would shock the public if they ever came to light. And guess who has been linked to attending some of these wild gatherings? Jay-Z. You have no choice. Harvey Weinstein, Jeffrey Epstein, Robert Kelly, Sean Combs have one person in common, professionally and privately, Sean Carter. Rumors are circulating that Jay-Z might have been more than just a casual attendee. Some speculate that he and Beyonce were possibly involved in these secretive gatherings, or at the very least, knew exactly what was going on. But why is this connection so significant now? Because these aren't just any run-of-the-mill parties we're talking about. These events have sparked serious accusations, and authorities are reportedly looking deeper into the people who are part of this elite circle. With Diddy now under intense scrutiny, it wouldn't be surprising if the spotlight eventually shines on Jay-Z and Beyonce. A lot of people have been questioning, well, she doesn't really know him. She has no knowledge of him. She doesn't have a picture with him. I'm smarter than Claudia Jordan. I would never take a picture with the devil. Everyone knew he was the devil. He's been the devil for 30 years. 
Let's back up for a second and unpack what's been happening with Diddy. A lot of this started when accusations began piling up about his involvement in shady dealings. Federal investigators have already raided some of Diddy's properties, including his homes in Los Angeles and Miami. According to reports, these raids were connected to allegations of illicit activities, and what was found during these searches is said to be more than just incriminating. We're talking hidden cameras, secret footage, and potentially damning evidence. Imagine the bombshell this would be if these tapes were to leak. And now there's speculation that some of these recordings might involve big name celebrities, potentially Jay-Z himself, which raises the stakes for the Carters even higher. Is it really a conspiracy if the same person keeps benefiting off the same kind of tragedy over and over? Rumors are swirling that these secret tapes captured during Diddy's infamous gatherings could be shopped around Hollywood. And if that's true, the fallout could be catastrophic. One lawyer, Ariel Mitchell, recently revealed that she was approached by someone trying to sell one of these tapes. Without revealing too many details, she dropped a bombshell by saying that the individual in the footage is even more high profile than Diddy. Could this person be one of the Carters? That's a million dollar question on everyone's lips right now. But the connection between Jay-Z, Beyonce, and Diddy doesn't end there. It's not just about the possibility of them being caught up in some wild party tapes. There are also deeper rumors suggesting that Jay-Z has been actively involved in helping Diddy cover up these scandals. Some insiders are speculating that Jay-Z, using his immense influence in the industry, has been pulling strings behind the scenes to keep Diddy's secrets locked away. If true, this would mean that Jay-Z isn't just an innocent bystander. He could be complicit in some of the most scandalous events tied to Diddy's inner circle. One of the most jaw-dropping rumors that surfaced involves Beyonce. There are conspiracy theories floating around that Beyonce may have played a darker role in protecting her and Jay-Z's interests. Some people are connecting the dots between her and the tragic story of Alea, who was once rumored to have a close connection to Jay-Z before his relationship with Beyonce took off. It's malicious. Well, maybe that was because he was the girl that didn't want you. Oh. According to some wild claims, Alea's untimely passing might not have been an accident at all, but rather part of a much more sinister plot. There's a theory that Beyonce, possibly jealous of Jay-Z's obsession with Alea, had a hand in ensuring that Alea had a hand in ensuring that Alea was no longer a threat. While this sounds far-fetched, it's not entirely out of the realm of possibility for those who believe that the Carters would go to extreme lengths to protect their empire. And then they brought Rich Harrison in, and you know, kind of think it's okay to ride now. She liked posing with him in pictures for, for page six. Aaliyah didn't. Jaguar Wright, who's been vocal about exposing Jay Z and Beyonce, even hinted that there are people who have firsthand knowledge of the Carter's involvement in questionable activities. She claims that there are witnesses who could come forward with evidence, not just against Jay Z, but also against Beyonce. And let's not forget about the infamous footage of Jay-Z and Solange in that elevator. Another incident that raises questions about what's really going on behind the scenes with the Carters. Was that outburst just a random family dispute? Or was Solange reacting to something much bigger that the public still doesn't know about? It's becoming clear that there might be more to Jay-Z and Beyonce's pristine image than meets the eye. Could their involvement with Eddie's world, their alleged connections to the hidden tapes and the unresolved questions surrounding Alea's passing all be part of a larger cover-up? There's a growing sense that something is about to break and when it does, it could send shockwaves through the entire industry. They were having a hard time taking her solo. And then Aaliyah. And while all this is happening, let's not forget the growing buzz about potential RICO charges tied to Diddy's inner circle. For those who might not know, RICO charges are usually reserved for cases involving conspiracy, where multiple people are believed to have been involved in criminal activity. With Diddy now facing serious allegations, including potential involvement in human trafficking and other illicit activities, the question is, how deep does this conspiracy go? Could Jay-Z and Beyonce, given their close ties to Diddy, be dragged into this legal mess? The very thought of it is enough to make anyone's head spin. There's no denying that the Carters are experts at controlling their narrative. They've managed to stay at the top of the industry for decades, carefully navigating controversies and maintaining an image of royalty. But now, with Diddy's world crumbling and more allegations surfacing, it seems like their usual methods of staying above the fray might not be enough. The more people talk, the harder it becomes for them to silence the growing whispers about their potential involvement in something much bigger than just the usual celebrity gossip. Ain't nobody around to tell them what to do and they just get to act a fool. Free Beyonce. She a prisoner. The idea that Jay-Z and Beyonce could be tied to Diddy's scandals is a storyline that no one saw coming. But as more details come to light, it's clear that this isn't just a fleeting rumor. From the hidden tapes to the wild parties to the possibility of federal charges, 
This situation has all the ingredients of a scandal that could define the next chapter of Jay-Z and Beyonce's careers. And with more voices speaking out, it's starting to feel like their once untouchable empire could be on the verge of a very public reckoning. And we haven't even touched on the fact that Jay-Z's name is also being floated in connection with other criminal accusations. Some sources are claiming that his influence in certain circles may have extended to helping Diddy and others avoid legal consequences for years. If these claims turn out to be true, it would confirm that Jay-Z's role in this scandal goes far beyond just attending a few wild parties. It would paint him as a key figure in a much larger network of cover-ups, one that's now on the brink of collapsing. One of the more recent developments fueling these suspicions is the increasingly frantic behavior of the Carter's legal team. Over the past few weeks, multiple online creators have come forward claiming they received cease and desist orders from Beyonce's lawyers. These are just small time bloggers either. Some of the biggest names in celebrity gossip are reporting similar experiences where they were told to remove content or face legal action. This kind of aggressive legal maneuvering suggests that the Carters are doing everything in their power to keep their names out of the growing Diddy scandal has done things and allegedly participated in a lot of things that the public would not be happy to know. But can they really keep the truth from coming out forever? With Diddy's legal troubles mounting and with investigators reportedly looking into everyone who was part of his inner circle, it seems like only a matter of time before more names get dragged into the fray. And if Jay-Z and Beyonce are truly as connected to these accusations as some believe, they could be in for a rude awakening. So what's next for Jay-Z, Beyonce? and their powerful empire. Right now, it feels like they're walking a tightrope, balancing their public image with the growing pressure from these rumors and allegations. Will they manage to stay ahead of the storm or will this be the scandal that finally brings them down? Only time will tell, but one thing's for sure, this is far from over. Celebrity, we, we were never a celebrity couple. We were a couple who just happened to be celebrities. That's beautiful. Like, like real people. Yeah. The cars might be powerful, but no one is untouchable. The rumors, the allegations, the mounting legal pressure, it's all pointing to a moment where everything could come crashing down. And as more people start to speak out, it seems like the cracks in their armor are becoming impossible to ignore. For years, they've managed to control the narrative, but now it looks like that control is slipping. You can be in love with someone. You can love someone and you not... And if you haven't experienced love and you don't understand it and you don't have the tools to move forward, then you're going to have complications. So keep an eye on this space, because if the rumors about hidden tapes, criminal connections and deeper scandals turn out to be true, this could be one of the biggest stories in entertainment history. Jay-Z and Beyonce may have built their empire on fame, fortune and power, but it seems like the walls are closing in and the truth might finally be catching up with them. Now that we've uncovered all these rumors and shocking allegations, it begs the question, how much of what we think we know about Jay-Z and Beyonce is carefully crafted? And how much is being hidden? Could they truly be involved in covering up scandals far beyond what the public imagines? Or is this all just a case of too many coincidences? Let us know what you think in the comments is. Do you believe their empire is about to crumble or is this just another test of their untouchable power? Drop your thoughts below and don't forget to subscribe for more updates.